In this video, I'm going to show you how to change the clock on a 2019 Subaru Legacy. This process will be the same on a Subaru Outback and um, most of their other models. This is easy to do once you know how to do it, but if you didn't know how to do it in the first place, this would be really hard. So it's on page 335 in just the owner's manual. We're going to start by turning the ignition on, put your foot on the brake, and then turn it on. First, we want to make sure the key's in the car, obviously, put our foot on the brake and start the car all right now we can start the process if we look at the owner's manual here it says press the home button go to settings vehicle clock adjustment so i'm at home right now i'm going to go to settings it might be a little hard to see the screen on camera then i'm going to go here to vehicle which is over at the side then on top there's clock adjustment we're going to click that and then there's two options here if yours is on auto you want to change this to manual right now it's already on manual if we look back down here, it says on the control switch, which is right here on the steering wheel, first we're gonna press the up arrow until we get to this menu right here on the dash where it has the picture of an I slash set, pull and hold, I set for menu. So we're gonna pull and hold this middle button right there and up on there you see it just changed in the settings. With these two buttons, we can toggle through the settings and we're gonna go to clock then click the middle button. Then you can toggle through here and we're gonna select adjust time. Now we have our time here and if we wanna adjust the time, we can take it up to six o'clock say, or take it down to two o'clock. Right now it is 3.30 and I'm gonna click okay. And then we'll click okay again if you wanna change the minutes. Then it says setting complete, it'll take us back here and then we'll go through until we see the go back button We'll go back, toggle through until we hit see the go back, and then toggle whatever setting display you want up here. Show your tire PS, PSI, I didn't know it had that. That's actually pretty cool. Um, radio stations, I'm gonna put it right there where it has your average fuel economy and how many miles are left on the tank. So that's the process to changing the clock in a 2019 Subaru. It's definitely tricky, especially if you didn't know how to do this. There's a lot of different steps. Just follow the instructions in the owner's manual, and it's kind of like a wiggle your nose and ears just to get it to work. But with all these different steps, you can change it, and I guess it's kind of not a surprise if that's why the clock was wrong. But now it says it here. It is 3.34 p.m., and it is correct.